Hey guys, and welcome to a new episode of the Apple Tutor. Today, we'll be looking at a robust gaming PC which can run any game seamlessly on a 1920x1080 resolution. This PC features some quality components that enhance the enthusiast's gaming experience and is placed at a budget of around $1200. The build also offers a few options and can be customized to your liking. Firstly, we have the Intel Core i5 3570K processor, which is great in terms of value. Now a lot of you might think that the i7 is a must for a high-end PC like this one, but that's certainly not the case. Most games right now require just 4 cores of processing power, making this CPU an ideal option, running in at $223.79. Next up, we have the motherboard, and we're going with the ASRock Z77 Extreme 4. This motherboard has great value, giving you all the builds and whistles you would expect, such as SLI and Crossfire, and the X-Fast 5x feature. This comes in at $145. Now for the memory, we're going with 8GB of the G-Skill Ripjaw X series. This comes with two 4GB RAM modules and is clocked at a whopping 2133MHz. This runs in at just $62.95. Now for the case, we're looking at the mighty NZXT Guardian 921. Not only does this case look amazing, but it also supports many features such as the constant temperature monitoring. This is priced at just $70. Now for our storage drive, we're going with the Seagate Barracuda 1TB mechanical hard drive. This is a 7200 RPM drive, giving you fast access times but does not match those of an SSD. This is priced at $83. Now for the video card, we're going with the MSI GTX 660 Ti Power Edition, running in at $309. This card has a triple over voltage feature, allowing you to adjust the voltage, memory, and PLL to improve gaming performance. The Twin Frozer 4 thermal design brings a new dust removal technology and an improved cooler. For our boot drive, we're going with the reliable Crucial M4 128GB SSD. This SSD will be able to hold our OS, as well as applications that need fast access to. This is not the fastest SSD in the world, but has blazing speeds, along with great reliability, and is priced at $128. For our cooler, we're going with one of the best air coolers, the Cooler Master TPC812. This is the first heatsink to use the vertical vapor chamber technology, and is up for any serious overclocking. This is priced at just $60. Now the next part is optional, but can be useful to many. We're going with the Sony Optical Drive, priced at just $25. For the OS, you have a choice. You can go with either Windows 8 or 7. Windows 8 will run you $95.88, while Windows 7 will run you $91.16. So how much does your wallet have to suffer in total? It's $1,202.62 with Windows 8, or $1,197.90 with Windows 7. This is a custom PC, so feel free to make any changes. Thanks for watching, and I hope to see you in the next episode of the Apple Tutor. Cheers.